More problems with a metro pool company. We first told you about this. Premier, premier pools and spas of Oklahoma City about a month and a half ago, allegedly putting customers out tens of thousands of dollars and then leaving them with unfinished pools. And now we've learned there's a lot more victims. News Force Natalie Kleinstone has been following the story and has our update. Well, Kites were last week, there were about 10 new lawsuits filed against the company. Each argues that Premier Pools and Spas of Oklahoma City violated its contract and owes these victims thousands of dollars. People are angry because they've lost a lot of money. 99% of them say that they wonder how he can sleep at night and do this to people. Problems keep piling up with Premier Pools and Spas of Oklahoma City. They keep coming out of the woodwork. Uh, with complaints. In March, we first told you about a handful of Oklahoma customers being out tens of thousands of dollars after doing business with the franchise's owner, Rafael Solano. Edmund lawyer Chris Harper says since our first story aired, he's helped about 10 more victims file lawsuits against the company. Numerous of these are like the one we had earlier on where he'd collect the money, 25 to 34,000, and never dig the ditch for the pool. Uh, those are the worst ones. Some of the pools he's actually got halfway through. Harper says they're all out at least $25,000. He shared these pictures with us showing the mess of incomplete pools left in some victims' backyards. The lawsuits argue that the franchise's promise to create a perfect backyard swimming pool is, quote, false, misleading, and fraud upon the customers. The likelihood that they're going to be able to recoup that money um, is very small quite frankly. Kit Letcher, the president and CEO for Central Oklahoma's Better Business Bureau, says unfortunately they're familiar with the company too and have given it a C rating. That stems from unanswered complaints. Her best advice for people looking to get a poll this summer, do your homework. We recommend getting references and talking to other people that have worked with that company. We reached out to Solano this afternoon, but we never heard back. And Harper says he believes Solano is currently using a different company name and different phone number to still sell pools, and he warns everyone to be cautious.